Okay. I said, hey, ladies. Yeah. All right. All right. We did it. We got the, the duo has reunited. I actually think I do want just more card draw in this deck. So I'm trying to think of what would actually be a useful card draw dude to put in there. Harrison Jones, maybe, 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 maybe. Actually, I kind of like this. I kind of like not having two Dead Man's Hands and just running a a Disparis and Jones. Let's give it. A, let's give it a shot, man. How many weapons are you running into? I mean, at least that lock cube lock uses that weapon. Yeah, it's basically not priest, and priest I actually feel okay against. Cold light is the way to go, but remember, we have a ban on cold light because cold light is getting moved to wild. Uh, Isn't that amazing? That they actually, they actually were like, dude, man, we got to get this cold light out of here. Sleep with the fishes. Do I want to hold on to that one? I don't actually don't think so. Paladin? No, because yeah. you won't. They won't all be damaged. Right? Oh well, I don't know. I mean, I they'll all have, have one health, so we'll just kill. It. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh my God! Look, everyone, everyone's so happy to see you, Rob. Dude, you're you're just you're a ray of sunshine, Rob. You bring positivity, cheer, and of course the most regal beard. <laughs> regal, wow. Yes, I'll take that. I'll take that I know it's else. like it's it's right on the line of regal and homeless. But like, <laughs> you, it's just so well shapen. Like well, if it if it frilled out, oh, instantly judgment. With the amount of time I spend in between Berlin, Los Angeles, and San Francisco, it makes sense that I would be right on that line between, <laughs> right. between either uh, very very rich tech billionaire or panhandling. <laughs> those are, All right, hold those on. are the choices. And in case any of you guys didn't pick up on it, Rob just insinuated that he was a tech billionaire. So we're going to go ahead and never let him live. No, no, no. In between. In somewhere, in be somewhere in between homeless and a billionaire. So oh, think, oh, okay. Think of how this hockey stick works, right? Like the billionaire is in like the fractions of a percentile. So chances yeah. are I'm somewhere at or below an, an, an average human. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead, and I'm just going to punch so this guy down. What was the motive? Okay. Okay. You were, take you were asking. Two damage guy prior to casting Acolyte of Pain, and you want to remove that thing to just avoid extra damage. Yeah. Extra EP. I mean, I, I, I am really just trying to stay alive against this guy. Okay. Um, which I think we can do. I didn't want to run up against a... Um, okay. Um, a, well, what's it's called... Um, if I played Acolyte of Pain, I didn't want to run up against a 3-2 weapon. Mm. Of which there is one notable one. But then also, this one, for instance, it says give your minions plus one attack. Yeah, so get another threat off the board so that you have one less body for him. Yeah, and if I played Acolyte of Pain, he could have had a 3-2 knife juggler. You're right, and then he would have just killed that. it, and then mm. had it alive. But then the next turn, you still have the AoE and the attack anyway. So you could, I mean, probably shouldn't be dying anyway from a lot of this stuff. Now you've got your dire horn, yeah. And oh, oh I love Ooh. this. It's like gain armor, then gain armor. Gain armor. Don't now, how this. do I want to deal with this? You know, I think what I actually do is this, and I just wait, because he either is about to have no steam. Yeah, you like you like. Well, if the chat says that, you know, for Rob, I try to do like silent acknowledgements so that I don't interrupt you. Oh, do they interrupt? Just be like, Sean, hold the Sean, phone. Look, chat. this look person at this. cares about me. Look at this. Let me actually make um, this a little lower. So I, Sean and I met. Hey, Geth Overlord. Yeah, it has been quite some time. I think I think I've said your name before. It sounds. Oh yeah, Geth Overlord. I'm gonna act like I do. Geth Overlord is <clears> he's old OG man. Sean and I met when I was working at Blizzard. Uh, uh, fuck. 2009? Well, let's tell the story properly. Okay, so I, I, I had just started the daily, and, um, oh, God. this I mean, it, it hurts me a little bit to just even begin to talk about no, this. No, well, from your side, I don't think, I feel like you definitely make it more painful than it than it is, you know? Yeah. Like, let's see, this is this it. side. Is that just barely? Yeah, I mean, I if can, we... I can pivot some shit. Let's actually, let me move this out of the way so that way we can get a better... Uh, is there a cat on here? I hope I'm not disturbing the cats. Right, let me move this a little bit. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to... Should we make it? Are we in there? So I think first things first, we're going to... Well, I mean, I can just tilt it back. There you go. Oh, wait, here. We're, we're fine now. Oh, okay. We, we okay. So I'm going to slam this. Oh, Scourge Lord Garrish is going to be so sick. Oh, yeah. And we're just going to keep... Yeah, keep I, I, feeling like, up. I like feeling this. Yeah. So then we just push this down a little bit. Oh, Great. Yeah. Ooh. 
Yeah, there it is. Yeah, so so I just started oh, doing power. Daily. You have a power hot emo? Yeah, yeah, isn't that great? Man, woo! Fuck yeah. Mm -mm. Lunar, I'm sure that you yeah. can. Also, the, with the help of uh, Rogan, maybe you can play it. Maybe you can put it on your face. Stealth until your next turn. Are we what serious with this? Can't you just kill this guy? Um, Don't put Rogan on your face. Don't do it. It doesn't, it doesn't make just, any sense. Just put Rogan wherever you really feel like putting Rogan. Wherever you want to put it. You know, so Be I'm your best Rogan. I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal for a billion. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna go into the face. Oh one. yeah, yeah, just get that damage in there. But yeah, so when I started doing the day nine daily, there was there was like no legal precedent for what it meant to make content around a game because it's not like chess or something where no one owns chess. Like Blizzard owned StarCraft, so what do I do now? Well, here, and this is also in an era where everybody else is just fucking taking the game and, like, coming up with whatever business model and, like, charging people for access to events or for content or whatever. So, like, total Wild West. And here's this guy that has already been in the community for shitloads of years, is already a national champion, right, through WCG. Ooh, I like, I like they're doing this here. He's already recognized as, scoot us as, over. as a big contributor to the community. And he's still not acting entitled about anything, so... Well, you yeah, so continue. so I, I, I actually, I called Blizzard, I called Rob, or I called Blizzard because I wanted to, like, touch base and talk about what my plans were and make sure everything was good and make sure that I was doing everything legally appropriately. Oh. Oh, way to go. And it, it was the first time I'd ever actually done, like, a business call on behalf of Day9 TV, the business. And I was so fucking nervous when I was talking to her. I was like, oh, hi, my name is Day9. And of course, on the other side of the line, like, I'm like, this is one of the most legendary, like, <laughs> right, like, top three legendary StarCraft personalities, people from I had no Red idea you even knew who I was, like, man. Yeah. Oh, I, w I was a big lurker on Team Liquid. I followed, like, OSL and MSL and shit. Oh, shit. And caught up. I was supposed to be at the WCG that you won. Which is kind of funny. Or the qualifier, at least. But my fucking friend, his dad took him. And they didn't call me. He wasn't my friend anymore after that. Well, that's that. That's how friendships and go out the window, man. Yeah, I God, I like having one dead man's hand in here and not two. It feels really nice. The game's muted? Yeah, it is. It's my bed. Why Sorry. do you want to hear the game? Why do you want to hear the game? We're telling you a story, man. This is an important moment in life. But dude, I remember it was so funny because like nowadays you just call someone, you just talk to them. You do this technique known as talking to someone like a normal person. But I didn't have that technique back then. I was like, hello, my name is uh, Sean uh, Plata. You may know me by my alias. Day what? nine or not, or not, or not, and that's okay. So you almost have to think about it, but think about it from like the other Strike. side. Don't you, do you want to attack into the left? Do you want to attack the middle guy? I can't. Oh, made, they're dead. He's made the choice for dead. us. Um, I did work for Blizzard before I worked at Blizzard. I worked for uh, MLG as a commentator for a little while. I my my dream was to be a uh, 1.6 pro back in like 2003, 2004. I had a team op in 2005. Uh, Dad said I couldn't travel with 20 somethings to CPL Summer in 2005. So, Wait, how old were you then? I was 15. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like, no, your team is all, you know, 20 year old, 20 year old dudes. You're not going out there. This is my house, my rules. Yeah. And then I <laughs> said, okay, dad, I'm going to make it my job. <laughs> and I started like making <laughs> demo reels. Um, I was applying for different sites for the next like year or so, still playing mostly shitty. I won't even say semi competitively. And uh, in 2007, six, whatever, Source came out and fucking destroyed the Counter Strike scene, <laughs> basically. Is what I'm saying. Like, just, it like, just murdered it. No, no one remembers the exact moment Black Friday for Counter Strike happened, but it was it was very black. We've it was dark. It was it. horrible. We had to block it out, mostly. You know, like it's like I had to go through what's that called? Like TSD? Associative audio, <laughs> yeah. like the, 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 the special <laughs> yeah. therapy where you like let your uh, yeah like that. I had to disassociate with that event with Source being released, um, but it was a blessing in disguise because I was applying to SourceRadio.com to cast, and a guy named Luke Bodenheimer. Uh, the hate for Source coming from a hardcore 
uh, gamer uh, perspective, like hardcore competitor perspective, was that the game had um, less discerning hitboxes and spray patterns. So what that meant was you had to use effectively less mechanics and practicing uh, to be an effective player. So it felt like some things were a little more random. Um, the pace of the game was also messed up because of the, some of the speeds, um, the, the acceleration and deceleration, and how that affected your recoil and shit like that. Anyway, uh, the so I was applying to Source Radio, and the guy said, "Look, Counter Strike Source is fucking dead. Suck Jack Art uh, is fucking dead. So, have you heard of MLG?" <laughs> <laughs> and I said, what the fuck is MLG? Because I was a hardcore PC gamer. I, I was only playing World of Warcraft, Counter-Strike, and Brood War at the time. A little bit of Warcraft 3, I liked All-Stars a lot. Um, An incredible discovery. Where was I? And he said, well, look, this game is dead, I can't pay you to cast <laughs> the past. Uh, it died. To, <laughs> this game died in my lap this morning. Yeah. Um, but if you're willing to buy an Xbox and learn Gears of War, then I can give you a job. So, I had an interview with Cyanide, Ryan, Ryan Cyanide Thompson, uh, and I started commentating. And I think it was Dallas 2006 was my first event, or Austin 2006? That was when I met Josh Latendris, and he had the first uh, alpha build of the Astro headset that would come to take over no. the market. So this is like before Astros had taken over the whole console market. So I like got to wear this, you know, fucking... The very first the Astro. Mil the million dollar Astro headset that I had just spent <laughs> like years developing. And I'm like, this fucking 16 year old kid <laughs> was stoked out of my mind to get paid a couple hundred bucks to talk about video games for... Oh my god, it's, it's actually hilarious how yeah. non the pay was. Uh, and yeah, man. Uh, but that's fuck. When you look at, we were basically getting paid to go to college. You know, it's like you're b making barely livable amounts of money. Oh, nice. I like this. Yeah, but I, I don't. I'm gonna take from Ooh, ten that's damage. A lot of damage. That's yeah. a oh, I thought that was the four two thing. But so if I no. Cannot take 15. Alright, I will. Oh, I'm to the face! This, I, I have so much trouble against tempo mages, man. All my decks struggle against them. Was there a reason why we didn't geist? Um, because it could have been explosive. Okay. Thing. Fuck. Oh, oh what All the right. fuck? I don't even know what the fuck we're playing wow. last time. That's the game. Alright, we lost. <laughs> oh, wait, no, are you sure? What is this? Was that not 15? No, no, I did not. I couldn't gain 15. Alright, well, you know, some, it sometimes it's 7 mana oh, better than Pyre Bust. I would've had, I would've had 9 health. You could've killed the left guy and... Been back and, and executed and had one of them left. Yeah. And then maybe then you have one draw, I guess, if he doesn't have lethal in him. Oh, uh, no, he, he, did, he, he, he has lethal on board. Yeah. <laughs> so no matter what. No, I, even if you killed the... Yeah, because I have four health, so I could... I couldn't kill either the... Of the I could kill just Leroy Jenkins for six. No, no, well, you could also... You had Execute, right? And they were already damaged. I, so I could have killed one with Execute. He would and have then had... the thing, and then he has to, oh, to 11 on board, plus one is 12, yeah. And your armor goes only... Two, were you at nine? I was at less? four health. Oh, so. okay, never mind. Yeah, okay. So, so we're, we're against him. Oh, so you would have had 11. So you were exactly... He had exactly lethal. Yeah, no, I just... I you just... Many steps ahead all, of him. All... All the, the delta just all flowed into shit. It was <laughs> awful. Every path led to shit. So we're against a warlock that generally is a controly guy. So this is this is the tough matchup. But I have not encountered that many warlocks. You're gonna win it. Uh, we're, we're, fucking crushing. we're in it to win it. Uh, so yeah, that was, that was basically it. Wanted to be short synopsis. Wanted to be a pro. Uh, dad, dad said I couldn't travel to play video games, so I started doing commentary. Tried to do commentary for Counter Strike, uh, but Source killed Counter Strike, so I was yeah. Uh, and it, <laughs> it lies dead to this day. Well, you could you know, there's all the other things with the CPU oh, stuff. Yeah, about the, 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 the things that were trying to happen at that time, and yeah. then. Uh, I got an offer at MLG, and then two years later, 18 months later, 16 months, Wait, MLG really? picked up World of Warcraft. 
and I did the first oh. 3v3 World of Warcraft tournament in San Diego. So that was like, and then uh, because all of the my managers at MLG were the guys working with the people at Blizzard hiring for this entry level position I was applying for, it happened to be that all of my references were names that they knew, and so when they saw my resume, I was able to go and had an interview and started writing content and commentating for Blizzard. And that catches us up to about a year later when we started releasing the uh, the alpha, or I guess you could say like playable beta, external beta for StarCraft. Um, oh, that, oh that's, that's right, you did the... Cause you were... I, did, I did the battle reports, I did some of that commentary earlier with our good friend Dustin Browder, the fucking legend. Oh my god, those were so good. Ahead of our time, dude. And then we we did the battle report for Heart of the Swarm Man. Yeah. When uh, when the Mothership Core, first of all, existed. <laughs> Rest in peace. Uh, but when the Mothership Core moved like so, so, or what did it teleport from Nexus to Nexus? It you know, could. I don't remember if it was to Nexuses or if it was just buildings. If you could just port it to pylons. Well, because remember, it was just it was, it was anciently just, slow. Yeah. It was like spookily slow. Yeah. It was, ominously slow. It, it was scary because it was like a it was a haunting presence <laughs> on the battlefield. All right, I'm I'm gonna throw down this and just keep going into face. This is what I really love about this is that it's obnoxious as hell if you are a control deck. Yeah. It's a lot of armor. It, yeah, you like because it, it's like a little more than a shield block and it has good stats for. A oh my god, Sean! The latter points are in the banana stand. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, I mean like I was I was looking, I was like, there has to be a banana somewhere. It has to be here if he's saying it. Where is the banana Where is Guys, where did he hide the banana? Um So I can't really kill any of this. I mean I can I guess I guess I'll I guess I'll just crack this. And then it's gonna hit him with the wooshy douches. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes. And then I, I guess. Want, no, you're not, you, are you saving execute? Um. Do you do you want to attack that with your four one or do you like keep it? I don't know shit. That's I'm not like, just asking. No, I don't. I don't know. I think I think I am gonna hold on to it. Just just a little bit. Ah, uh, yes, dark, Darker Roast, that is me. I uh, think it's a little bit of a as well. Um, that was the forum name that I used when I was right. a user. Okay, L -A -R -H. Um, oh so that's what they Oh my god, that's... That's where Malar comes from. Yeah, well, Malar came from Malarjalad. Yeah, that's that's that is the name that I know. Yeah, which was initially from my, my friend Chris Hopkins in Livermore. Growing up in Markel. That had he used to make the funniest flash animation. You know, but I still think his shit was super fucking funny. But if I go back and watch it, it's probably not as funny as I remember it being. Like most things when yeah. you're young. Oh yeah. Like when you go back to check, like, oh man, I fucking loved Samantha Jean from the fourth grade. Let me go take a look back. And this isn't even considering that, like, man, you're old now. You're probably not going to find a 10-year-old attractive anyway. But when you go back, you're also surprised at how unattractive your crush was. <laughs> this is, you know? <laughs> all, all names and people have been replaced. In this. Okay, okay. Oh, my God. Unless you just, like, call it out and be like... No, 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 no. I want, I want everyone to know that there's a 10-year-old... That's in the that past <laughs> that was actually <laughs> ugly and I was wrong I was like that's awful this is an awful story I feel no, bad I'm just saying how the things that you loved are not as pretty as you remember them to be oh dude well you know the, the, I'm, I'm worried about the day that I go back and rewatch The Rescuers Down Under why are you worried about that day it is <laughs> it, just as good as you think it is is it yeah like is, is it really that good I mean I don't know I only watched it for the sound Wait, you only watch it? For the, yeah, the music. The, like, it the, did, why why, did, it why did you not kill... What? So you could, have, you could have used Geist to attack that and Weapon to attack that. Uh, and the uh, demons. Uh, yeah, but I just want to hold on to this because this is so much damage. I don't, I don't really care that much about that. Super. 
That's a bear. Okay, watch this. See, we're gonna we're gonna hit him with this. We're gonna. Let's draw. Yeah. Oh no. Because I feel like we're talking this, but no. Ah, it's covering oh, it's up the screen. screen. Yeah. Fuck it. Fuck it, man. I'll just talk louder. Oh wait, wait. If we literally just turn it. Just yeah, hold on, hold on. Oh yeah. yeah. This can work. This can work. We can make it work. This make it work. I oh, know. I think. I, I mean, he's just gonna blood reaver us. I actually just removed the large scale removal from this deck. So that's maybe kind of. Maybe it's kind of bad. Hmm? Darkness rises. What did you? What's large scale removal? Do you have? Oh my God! He has three of them now. Ah. Why? Because he used the Stonehill Defender to get one. He's a real, he's a real shitter. Ah, fucking asshole. I hate him. Hot. Killing Dom Perry. Ray. Yeah, we take that for sure, right? Because you want him to attack it, and it's got three HP. You still have that three HP that everything's damaged to. Yeah, I got, I got, I got, I got, got two sleep with the fish. Oh, so, so much fish sleeping. It's gonna happen. <laughs> oh my God. We are the biggest fish slut. <laughs> we are such a fish slut. I'm just trying to sleep with all the fish. Or I guess our opponent. We're trying to make our opponents into fish sluts. Uh, I just want everyone to die. Okay. Uh, all right. There's Ren. We have our dead man's hand in, in hand for once. For once. What is that? How does that help you? Because this blows my deck up. Mm. So I can reshuffle. Oh, at the end. I can shuffle a deck into my deck. Okay. That's going to be very helpful. So this is going to be very long and very grindy. So I can... <laughs> if Exhibit played Hearthstone. I heard you like decks. So I think I... Run this down. Cut. Okay, and then I, and then I play this one out. So we're just gonna try to gain some armor. Bonk him. This game is gonna take forever, man. No he, he, exaggeration necessary. He's gonna mill a card. We're gonna hope that he mills Nazoth or Blood Reaver Bulldog. My hat needs to be plated beetle. God, What's that is the worst. Beetle? It's a 2 3 that death rattle oh, gives you 3 oh, armor. Three armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I remember this fucker. Okay, hey, so we you stopped the story. You're getting... Uh, what, what, what was the story? What were you talking about? You were getting to saying that you were looking for licensing. And we ended up on the phone. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's right. And that was the beginning oh, of our relationship. Yeah, yeah. And and Rob was just super chill in there the entire time. And I was like, this is like shit. Look, and Sean was getting ready to do the, was it King of the Beta tournament? Oh, is that right? Because right? uh -oh. you were trying to figure out, like, first, I want to broadcast this at my day nine launch thing. Oh, right that's the right. Party was yeah, 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 yeah. I was yeah. to make sure you had licensing for that. The licensing didn't really matter, but the headache was the beta was closing, so you didn't have server access, so we had to Five figure out a workaround yeah. so that you could access the replays to watch the finals for the show. Um, that was when you had... I, I had been invited to come your magic shall be a part of your hosting you. team for the, for the event. Oh, yeah. Instead, I chose to be a company man. And I went to uh, to Fry's Electronics for the official like Starcraft <laughs> yeah. launch thing. And not a day goes by that I don't oh. think about how I wish that I would have gone to Sean's fucking launch party. <laughs> that was that was one of the greatest events ever. Man. It that was event fucking was so incredible. Cool. It was also the beginning of uh, JP and Starcraft at that I think. Or that that was like the beginning of you guys casting. Aside from this like, small thing, maybe like one thing had happened with MLG prior to. And that was why I just think like, God damn it. It could have been me. It could have been you. <laughs> but hey, look, I'm here right now. Yeah, so that's great. Right. Yeah. What's JP doing? Huh? He's, a, he's having he's a blast, man. He's killing it. He, yeah, he's, he's, he's fucking killing it. Best way. I miss that fucker. St. Louis. Ah. Uh, oh, yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. 
He's got one of the greatest laughs and smiles. Oh, dude, he's so he's so jolly. Oh, new house. I am the Shaz. Sick. Okay, so let's do this first. Yeah, this is this is a pretty damn good pile of cards to have here. I think I'm gonna try to hold on to this one. Oh, really? Why do that? Um. That belongs in a museum. Why that, you say? Yeah, it's that face. Um. Because I want to make sure it's dead for when I Nizoth. He's just gonna Azari, isn't he? He might not. Oh, wait, no, no, no. He had, he had one more. Yeah, oh, dude, we're in such good shape. Ooh, thanks, Kaiser. Side effects? No. Trust me. Okay, so. I think we definitely do this. Oh, that's nice. That's a real nice pickup. We have to hit this one. Cool. Then we don't use this. I think we're okay. We do this. Sleep on the fishes. Yeah. Yes, this is, this is a nice, this is a nice hand to have. Kind of stinks that both the dire. Oh uh, wait, couldn't you use sleep with the fishes before the AOE and just let him keep up the two two, and then you would have kept your guy because he has full HP. Uh, I couldn't have kept my guy, my my five four, because I'm dealing one damage to it, and then I'm dealing sleep with the fishes damage. Yeah, but if you do the sleep with the fishes damage first, then the only creature that you wouldn't have hit is the. Do, do, do they do they have damage on them? Yeah, because oh. you did the two the shield slam the left one, and then and then you could have attacked the. Oh no, I guess if you would have done the AOE at all, you would have sacrificed the mixologist. So we're we're just waiting. We're just waiting here for a very long time. Son of paint. Let's volunteer. Find a place that's close to you. There's not uh, when you think about the industry, the industry is relatively small. Well, let's 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 read his question. Out loud. It says, "I'm a college yeah. student who's the VP of his college's esports division. I'm looking to get into the esports industry. Do you have any suggestions for how to find summer internships in the industry?" So Dude, spam, questions. spam so hard. Volunteer, look, just spend hours googling, send out messages, go to companies that have up and coming competitive games, reach out to them, ask if there's ways you can help, think of ways that you could help and propose those in the email. Yeah, also the, I mean, like the Overwatch League just basically created like 200 more jobs in the industry. Yeah. You know, like overnight, now there's all these teams that need coordinators and entry-level people who learn stuff. Uh, it depends on what being a VP of the esports division means. Are you, are you running competitions? Yeah, you know, no. like, are you running weekly shit? Yeah, in your titles don't mean shit. What do you yeah. do? <laughs> are, you like, are you building a community locally? Are you organizing people and trying to trying to get youth involved in shit? Like this is so know? smart. Purple feels as we need a Robbie mode. I know. Well, I will I think I think he's, he left on accident. Oh, great. He mm, left fine. on purpose because it's fucking free. Get the fuck out. He's frightened. Alright. Okay. Okay, well, he does that. So this this kind of stinks. I kind of would have ideally liked to keep this stuff, but he's he's trying to hold. Wait, are you sure that you don't want a dead man's? Oh, because he hasn't. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. For some reason, I thought this was a, someone a 5-5. Five, five. No, I definitely don't want a dead man's because yeah, he'll push all my deck up. Yeah. I think this guy's just owning me. He's really good. Oh my. Yeah, I don't think this deck beats uh, a guy who's playing his deck correctly. Shoot, shoot. Shoot, shoot. Oh, 
shit, shit, shit. Yeah. Shit, shit, fire, shit. Because he has another twisting nether, and uh. Oh my god, really? Yeah. And he's got lifesteal, and he's still got his big man, right? The destroy everything, the seal man. Yeah. That's a fucking good deck, man. With the love of the my local gaming industry, we have a focus of regional gaming in the area of my computer. What? Aaron Tule, would you mind? Oh, he the messed up. Focus of regional gaming in the area of your computer. Oh, sick. Well, Son of Paint was the first guy that asked me. Well, that's awesome, dude. You should just run summer programming for those people. Like, that that type of experience can score you, uh, like, an actual position. Yeah, dude. If you're, uh, Son of Paint says that he's already organizing local community events. Just keep doing that. Make it bigger. See if you can find people that will give you money to do it bigger. Yeah, Aaron 2A, that wording got me real good. Alright, it's Nazoth versus Nazoth. I think maybe his Nazoth is maybe a little bigger than our Nazoth. It's not the size, it's what you do with it. But mm -hmm. at some point, it is the size. <laughs> uh, the favorite Ethiopian dish is whatever Sean orders, because I don't know. I, I'm like, I'm gonna say the thing with like the spongy bread that I use to pick up the, the, the chicken sauce with my hands. Oh, yeah, that's the dish. Oh my. Man, he's getting a real cocksucker at this point. So, we do this. And then we can certainly do this. You were being a real interesting player right now. Yep. He's taken some pain. And see, we have another Bring It On, another Diahorn Matriarch, and another Nazoth the Corrupter. See, I'm going to hope we draw Nazoth. The worst draw would be this, for sure. We're taking oh, he still damage. heals three and then attacks the armor? It doesn't make, how is he stealing life if he's only attacking your no, armor? It's, it's yeah, just deal three damage, heal for three. So this helps. This does oh, help. Don't you want to use that? And then AoE. Oh, you can't. Oh, you can't. Uh, I think I just want to hit this. I think I just want to get the thing lower. I probably do. Does he reduce the big man? Oh my god, look That's at that That's real lucky. Look at that board. I really hope that we just finished talking about how this thing is like impossible. He might just be able to kill us nice. with lifesteal, hellfire, hellfire. <laughs> Oh. Yes, he fucked up because we heal for six twice. Thank God. Ooh, thank God. Thank wow. God. Wow. And he, he just killed up. all his shit. He killed his board. He killed his board. Oh my God. Yes, he messed up wrong. Now, we can still maybe lose though, right? No. If he's got anything in hand. Do we know what he has in hand? He has, he has nothing. I mean, he has like double. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, it would have been better to just double. Uh, yeah, I'm just not getting because double die would have got you through, I guess. Actually, he's still taking. He's taking a lot of turn. Oh my god, that's so good. That's legit. He's ta he takes seven next. That's annoying. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's okay. You just cast both of them. Or or I draw bring it on on it and I gain ten armor. Uh, actually, do armor now. Oh no, I can't armor. Oh, yeah. Because then next turn you would get the one additional, and then you attack three for six, and he's dead. But I guess that he's dead. You can just pass turn if you. No, because he's gonna have life. So. And he's like Shadowborn. Nope. See, we're we're still in good shape. I think we should still be in good shape. It takes eight. All right. So he, he needs to kill us this turn. Bloody hellfire. I mean, he, he, I, I don't think he has direct damage, but he might. <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! 
Oh my god, we we did not deserve to win that game. That's so funny, man. This deck is this is a powerful deck. It's really good. All right, well, wait, well, that took, that took about half an hour. Let's go ahead and queue right up into the next one. This is great. So, what is your motivation or reasoning behind choosing this deck that takes quite a lot of thinking and time versus like the traditional, you know, fifty-five, forty-five? Hunter grinder. Because um, I feel like this deck creates interesting decisions, and that's all I'm really playing for, man. I'm just in the mood for some interesting decisions. Um, I mean, I like there's an aggro paladin that's very, very strong right now uh, that I think is really beautiful, but um, like it's 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 a lot of the latter. I think it's it's something like. I think it's like 25, 25, 25, 25 split among warlocks. Priests, paladins. Actually, I think it's closer to a third, a third, a third of just those three. Really? Or maybe it's like 25% of each of those, and then like 25% everything else. And this is called balance. A Theodon array. I can spell that thing. Uh, Would I rather fight a hundred duck sized Shans or one Shan sized duck? Theodon heretic. Uh, I think the obvious answer is a hundred. Duck sized shots because all I would have to do is have like a couple iPad setups and I could have a huge tournament with mini shots. Oh my god, that would be so <laughs> awesome to find out the best mini shot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's such a that's such a great answer. That is such a great answer. I'm actually just gonna armor up and pass. Um, because I have a lot of nice combos that I can do. Cool. But I'm just gonna wait. Oh my god, that would be so cool. God, there'd be 99 depressed mini Shans, you know? <laughs> just like, I can't even beat myself. Let me tell you, that, that one Shan that did win would be arrogant inside. <laughs> Not a, externally, no, but inside it'd be like, yeah, I know it's fucking well, right. Okay, so here's the thing that I've been uh, like obsessed with. Mm. Recently. Not, a, not obsessed with, but that's a very specific thing. Uh, an idea that... Yeah, there are. Here's some things. I say. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I have put prior thought into the statement that is coming next. Brother. This isn't That's an right. accident. I didn't need to Here exaggerate. Uh, the like humans have mutations, right? Like there's like one percent of people, one and a half percent of people only really need to sleep like three or four percent, uh, three or four, three or four hours a night to operate. At a, in a relatively normal way, you know, you look at like a lot of different CEOs or people that are running companies and shit like that, and this, mm -hmm. this type of thing is true. Uh, so, I'm just thinking about, man, if I had a hundred mini Shans, what would the different mutations be? Uh, I'd have a Shan that doesn't need to sleep. I'd probably have like a hyper-athletic Shan. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. yeah. And then, and then the, like the ultimate mm -hmm. power hot evolution. Not three to four percent sleep. God damn it, Doctor Rose is going to let me down. I can't handle. I can't handle sleeping. Uh, well, I should sleep more. Is what I, yeah. I should say. Yeah. But it's gamer life, man. You yeah, know? dude, that would be interesting. I mean, like, like. That that is a reality I would want to live in, where it to to see my full potential, it would just be simulations of clones of me populating Dude. most of the world. Yeah, yeah, that well, would the, be uh, the Black Mirror episode from this season. Did you have you watched the season I, of Black Mirror? I, I only saw the Sex with the Pig episode and the Guy Who Bicycles to Enter Contest episode. Oh man, was it? I feel like you might have missed the point. Maybe, maybe you did. <laughs> Let me tell you, I think my understanding of just all things is not sophisticated. Oh! Slam a jamming! Yes! And then we get Scourge Lord Gareth! Scourge Lord Gareth! Yes! I don't know that he was going to use his attack anyway, though. I think he was going to use his 3 3 dude to kill your 1 3. That is fine by me because I gobbled up his is claws! Is, is there another weapon that we're afraid of? Um, so many jade things. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, there... You can shake his jade thing. Don't be taunt. There's a really yeah. great episode about finding love that I can't spoil now. But it has to do with a similar scenario to what... Actually, if you haven't fucking watched it, I'm just gonna spoil this shit. 
Okay. Guys, a spoiler for Black Mirror coming up. Spoiler alert. This is a, has an episode that is about, uh, that, that shows a guy entering into a relationship and they have a phone that when you first meet, it tells you how long, there's some, oh fuck, I don't remember the decision, but basically when we sit down to get to meet each other for the first time, you're like assigned a date, basically. You sign up for this app and the app tells you that you will find the love of your life if you use this app and just commit to it. Uh, so the way that it huh. works is that they go and get this assignment, you meet at a restaurant, whatever, and you uh, you have the choice of either looking at how long you'll spend together or agreeing to not to and just seeing how the, how the relationship goes. It's kind of fine, so long as the light. And it's all going really well, but it starts getting so nervous, it's indicating him that maybe our relationship is going to end soon. So he reveals it, and of course, when he reveals it, that changes the dynamics of the relationship because he broke trust, and then their relationship ends. His next relationship, he's then like stuck in for like five years with somebody that's just miserable and they hate each other. And it's like the worst thing in the world, so he's starting to give up on this whole idea. Uh, when they get to the end of their time, then he is reconnected with the girl that he had first broken trust with in all of this. And then it's revealed that this is all happening within a simulation where on this dating site they're running millions of different compatibility tests in different relationship scenarios to find out the, the love of your life. And so it shows that like they broke out of the system however many times. And so this is how you can find the ultimate shot. Fuck! That is so deep I forgot to hero power. Ah! Oh, damn. Wow. Yeah, it's really cool. Just watch it. You missed enough of it that it'll still sound good. God damn. Yeah, I mean, like, I, I, I wonder. <laughs> I, I really am interested in the whole like this reality is being simulated. This, well, okay. So the well, we can get really, really weird on this. Mm -hmm. um, what is the definition of a simulation? I guess it starts by defining, like, that we need to define what reality is and isn't, and that, like, if reality is effectively just the product of our shared consciousness, then everything is just a simulation based on our choice. I mean, I mean, in more than literal sense. <laughs> like, there is... Like, there is a reset button somewhere that yeah, could that, be like, there, there is, there is, like, we are one meta-reality, like, weather storm away from ceasing existence, man. Like, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, so I think I whack, spin, and win. I love it when you whack and spin. And win. Well, I'm I'm more focused on the winning. You're focused on the whacking. Okay, hold on. See, see we go. Mm. Bop. Dot five. Drop. Drop. Skip it up, bye. Dude, I should just... Anytime I start singing a song, I literally need to commit and not finish. Or not stop until I'm finished. I always I need commit to commit and, and not finish. finish. <laughs> <laughs> Sending a lot of mixed Sometimes, messages. A lot of times I commit and I can't even start. <laughs> Don't be taunt, please. Yes! Oh my, oh my god, sick. You're like that one time. Alright, so we hit like this, we bop like this, and then we play this is what I'm trying to click upon. Dude, the slow, grindy control. Captain Adama. Oh god, I love in season two. <laughs> Captain Adama doesn't go up, but he slowly grinds his way to Earth. Oh, oh it's such a sick show. <laughs> One boomer betrays the fleet for a Cylon. Dude, okay, so here's the joke. Here's 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 why we're we're chuckling so much. Um oh, we have a mutual friend named Matt that just arbitrarily brings up <laughs> facts about um uh, Battlestar Galactica. Just whenever 
like we're in a game of Dota and we're winning, and we're just like, oh, that fight was so good, and he's just, oh, this is almost as good as that one time in season four, <laughs> when, and he just keeps bringing up like more and more obscure. Like he, I don't think he enjoyed Battlestar Galactica that much, but he enjoys referencing it all the time in stupid situations. Well, and it's also like keep in mind most of the time that we're interacting with him, we're playing Dota, yeah. which is like highly technical game, and so this type of like. You know, nerdy. Like, <laughs> it's just very nerd meta. Very, yeah, super nerd meta. Oh, what is this? What is this Garbo? What is this Garbo man? Okay, now. Fucking trash can. Well, first Big watch this. Trash can. We're go we're gonna slam him. Slam him. And jam. then we're gonna we're gonna run down the skulking Geist because he might have evolves in there. But first, before we do that, we're gonna play in the correct order because we're taking the time to explain. And did we get the evolves? No. What kind of deck is this man? Not Running. Evolves. He's not. It's not a deck at all. It would be amazing if there was a deck of cards playing a deck of cards. That would Whoa. confirm my suspicions about <laughs> simulated realities. <laughs> this is is this just deal damage? These trade players. Uh, what an what an eye roll bore. Um do I do you just have to um, do that and sleep with the fishes? I mean, yeah. Or do you put all your current cards back in your deck because you don't really have anything you need to duplicate in there before you sleep with the fishes? I so think this is, two more I think this is great. Fishes. This is a great sleep with fishes. Run this. And I'm gonna. Does this? Oh, and it goes in. And then Bang! And then we're gonna. Zoop. Yeah, you kind of just definitely don't forget to. Ah, you didn't forget. Yeah, there is. Do I want to play this Bring It On now? No, I probably want to play the Bring It On. Get the Dire Horn or something. Get the Acolyte. Get the Nazoth. Second Nazoth. That'd be cool. Yeah, this is straight five, Goku. We actually, we never had a chance. So I think that, like, he's almost out of JD dudes. He's played both the, the big, the small, the long, the tall. I taste the essence of a small amount of minions. Uh, uh. God, that was so awesome when that guy just double hell fired and, like, you know that he just went bite, throw, throw, and he just, like, tossed it out. Whoa. Oh! Yeah, look at this value! This was what great! The fuck? Well, we wanted the extra card in the 12 armor, though, didn't we? Yeah, okay, yeah. But this we is okay. Really we did. can we look really at this. Did. is glass half full, though, guys. This is fine, yeah. You know what? I was only, like, half a glass worth of thirsty anyways. <laughs> Sean the Opportunist. <laughs> That's right. It's very particular. He actually might run us out of cards no he won't because we can keep hatching cards into our oh grumble world shaker what a fuck jesus christ oh my god oh 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 my god can he he can probably bounce no he's not gonna run a bounce effect dude he's not gonna we're just gonna we're gonna hit him for five Thanks to Millhouse Mana Storm, we can do these maneuvers. <laughs> Very satisfying to say. You will actually. always have a career as a as a foley imitator. Yeah, you can just that's right. yeah. <laughs> like why ever need to wave around random objects and record a studio? Or, yeah, that's right. I mean, some people are imitation <laughs> Elvises. <laughs> I'm an imitation foliest. I'm an imitation swirly swordman. <laughs> I'm actually gonna hold on to this off because I think he's out, right? Because if he has two jade spirits, two jade claws, two jade chieftains. Uh, I a black paw, and he bounced a thing. So he should be able to get up to 9-9. Nine, nine. Right. Oh, and he has oh, two jade lightnings. Yeah. Right. So you can get up to oh, okay, that's it. This is, this is how we win. We win our opponents mess up the game! Rank 5!
Rank 5, dank 5. Knowing how to stay alive. Actually, this is great because I am slowly making my way towards 500 wins. I already have, like, 1,100 wins with, like, the other classes, but every warrior game takes about four to five times as long as every other class's games. Oh, you need wins, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Vol says this deck wins by fatiguing your opponent in real life. <laughs> we just we just hurt him a lot. He's just like, why? Inside why are you body, playing yeah. Warrior? Why? Just get me out of this game. And then he queues up against a Paladin. He's like, yes. Oh, yes. here they just crush it. The yeah, Paladins are like... Shaman crushes Paladin? Well, it's just like... Or Paladins just like... Yeah. Paladins are just five minute decks, man. You just play it and you're like a one, one, 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 a one, one. Buff them to three threes. Did we win? No? Concede. Play again. Oh, this is new. I, or it has a little, I, don't know, I don't remember. This is when they first did the dungeon. Yeah. It. Wiggle the gems, I'll wiggle them, and then I can wiggle this off and blows up. And here's the best part: is that there's a key right, right in here somewhere. Oh man, I hope he doesn't guess this. Uh, that's probably the weird one. Oh, oh he, he fucked up. He like doesn't even know what we are. I don't know what he is either. But the important thing is that we have mutual respect for one another. Hence the name Bearded Rogue. It's kind of like what you are. You're bearded. I am a bearded rogue. You're bearded. I, I always played rogue. Oh, that's right. You are such a rogue spammer. Golly, yeah, golly, gall. Spell first, early, early spell power rogue, early spell, God, yeah. fucking spell power druid. That was my shit. But like, cause bear, uh, <laughs> chat, chat is for fight. Did you ever see that? Uh, that wow, shit, doesn't. Oh, never mind. Nerdy meme stuff. Thank you, memes. I don't know anything that Rob is saying to me. This guy developed a, a really legendary post uh, on the World of Warcraft forums back in the day about like, explaining the different ways to play a druid at a high level. His name was Alamo. You can still look it up. Or it's 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 Alamo. It's archived somewhere, but it goes into it, and he's just spelling things poorly and talking about how like Drew Durid Durid is for fight, <laughs> Bear Durid is storm, like all of this oh, stuff that carried through the next many many years. Uh, I have not. I had, John Lewis was asked if I played the King's Bane Road. I have unfortunately not been uh, active in, in Hearthstone as much as I would like. So I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just quack. Why don't we just sleep with the fishes? Because this is not really much of a bard controller. And when I mean, we'll get to draw, which I think is important, a little bit near death. Is he just gonna heal that? <gasps> oh my god, I have Skulking Geist. And oh, I can just, no. oh my god, he can just, I can just destroy his entire deck. Never mind. Oh, oh, this is not great news. This is not. I mean, it's not the best news I've ever heard. Oh, great news! I mean, bet you know, all things considered. Weird news. Weird news. I'm actually not sure what to do with this news. You're still gonna perform the same action, I think. Like, I think you still have to skull and dice this turn. I don't think I do, because I think that this is this is a spiteful summoner deck, so it's not running inner fires. Have ones? Okay. Uh, yeah, because this says cast a, a reveal spell from your deck, summon a random minion with the same cost. Yeah. So oh, I got that. I don't think that he will. Really, I don't think he will really have room in that because he doesn't want to like spiteful. This this is one of the priest decks that's really popular. It just runs a shitload oh, of high high cost uh, spells. Yeah, it runs two. It runs twenty six minions and then two free from embers and two mind controls. Huh. It's pretty cool. Honestly. So I want to preserve the executes for that. Ew. Are we just dead? Probably. I mean, I can... We can bring it on. I might cut the bring it on, because it doesn't actually seem as necessary. Destroy some of my own spells, so that way we can maybe draw some fucking shit. Did you destroy Whirlwind? 
Oh yeah, I just read Whirlwind and Shield Slam. Man. They're not really draw the best. Oh no, whoosh bar. Flash. You know, I I actually think that this is the deck that I want the Blade Flurry against. What's what's Blade? Blade Flurry, Flurry is spend all your armor, deal that much damage to everything. Mm. Oh yeah, you had this in the deck when I was yeah, and I was here for version version, version whatever <laughs> version faggot version God. I'm so sad right now. You don't have to. Oh, do. we lose. Can we live one more turn? Probably can. Okay, so I think the first things first. We're gonna sleep with the fishes. Depends on how many things this recruits. Okay. This is okay. We can kill this outright. Four, five, six, Does he seven. Have eleven. Does it, or he needs one more damage, right? Yeah. Just twelve. We're rocking out of fourteen. is a little late. Honestly, I'm a little frustrated to see a Blood Razor there. So this guy is not going to help us. I think you, yeah, I think you execute, right? Or do you I think wait? I'm going to have to... I think I'm going to... I think I'm just going to cry. Yes. Yes. This guy down. Wooshy douchy douchy. We execute this. Yeah, he just had us dead. Oh, there's no other way to go. Let's let's take a look. It's in a book. I felt okay against priest before. You know, I think maybe we're actually just okay. I think we're actually okay. This is the thing I always find really weird about Control Warriors, is that they just, like, they draw so few cards. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> Until you set... Yeah, I don't know. Do you ever get that draw for each damage thing? Is that good for you ever? Garrosh versus Uther. I don't know if that's that even still... That I will could be. Fight with honor. <clears throat> I mean, I, w I would just generally like more draw in here. Like, we could just cut Harrison and put that in. We're up against the Paladin, this one's gonna be, this is gonna be a joke. The, the Harrison Swing is nice though, if they have weapons. It really is. I mean, really is. is, does Geist actually... I think, mm -hmm. I think I want Geist to blow up the Inner Fire Priest. I think the big problem I had is I just misread what his deck was. That'll do it. That'll, that'll get you. Well, Flotch, it's been many years since I saw you. I didn't suddenly grow this beard. It's been a very hard-earned six months. I always had too much facial hair if left unkempt. So I had this I had to just shave it all off before. I was also I had this thing in my life where like I just really wanted to be the most efficient. So it was like, okay, what's the best way to run the shower time to basically zero? Get rid of all the hair. So that I could, and this is this is a oh. this is legitimate reasoning. It was so that I had time to shower in between, like the light two and three minute uh, cues in World of Warcraft, that was a so mistake. that I could play all oh. day. Yeah. It was like I'm not gonna waste the time washing hair and fucking conditioning it. Yeah, what's that? Get in there and just, just same soap everywhere. Done. Back in the arena. So, I'm really feeling that it will be very nice to draw a thing that kills almost, all of his stuff. Almost anything, yeah. It'd be really cool if you played a weapon. That'd be pretty cool. Probably gonna be... Mmm, fire nice. Thank you. 
Sean and I play Dota. Theoda and Arate asks, I mentioned that I play Dota with Sean. What position do I like to play in one of my favorite heroes? I only play Shadow Fiend. Mid. That's it. And this they is a conflict because Sean likes to play mid because he's actually I actually the game. I actually don't like mid anymore at all. Oh, perfect. Yeah. yeah. But now they've fucked you, so they fucked up Shadow Fiend. Like Shadow Fiend. Yeah, he, he used to have damage stacks. Oh, come on. He doesn't have... I guess I'll Dance. do it. I guess we need to sleep with the fishes. This shield Shield grow. <laughs> shield grow. Um, it used to be that his uh, rays would get an 80 damage stack for each stack of rays. And they removed that, so he, it goes for now 50, 60, 70, 80 based on the level. Fucking owned, man. His shadow rays never had to do with his souls. What do you mean? No, like like shadow rays has stacks now. So if you hit him with a shadow rays, and then you hit him again, it'll deal eighty bonus damage. Oh, how is that worse? Now it's instead of dealing eighty damage per stack, it's fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, based on what your level of shadow rays is. Weird. So they had already changed it from being like 300 damage. Oh, shit. We're dead, man. We are so dead. We are just are we dead. I them? actually think these these are the... You know what? I think these are the culprits. Oh, I'm getting... Shit. I'm getting out of here. Does that deal 5 damage? Do you have 5 armor? I just don't think this deck is good. I think that's maybe the big problem with it is that it's a bad deck. I think that might be the issue. So if I go to the Zoth Value Warrior, we can, let's see here, we can get rid of Mountain Fire Armors and put, like, Taunts in here. That might be better. Hmm. Yeah, so yeah, I guess the 6 armor doesn't... And we keep fucking killing those guys when we, with our AoE shits. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do this one... Really? Infested Torrent? Is there not something higher value? Um, some rare shit or something? I, I don't think there's that much of a need for... Something super high value. But, I mean, there's just, you're gonna tell me that's the best four cost taunter available? Uh, it's pretty like much. You specifically want death row. Ticking abomination. It's not really that many good. I don't think there's actually almost any. What about any. that? The thing that we're just looking at was the, that guy, the skeleton guy. A lot of people board clears. Skelemancer. Uh, the other one before that, the, the lower cost one. The four cost one. Yeah. Let's see does a 5 5. Oh, just kidding. For this your one. opponent. <laughs> I, just, I could just be yeah, summoning skeletons. What about, what about Mr. Ushra? Umbra. Umbra? Whenever it uh, triggers Death Rattle Effect, the Mortal Combo card. Can we, can we be a carnivorous cube warrior? Uh, well, then Nazoth will summon cubes that don't have any effects on them. I think I just want to... Six bodies isn't bad. I mean, we don't have very many other good you know, death rattle let me, anyway. I hold that. Let me just hang like this. I mean, like, I just don't like playing Mountain Fire Armor against the aggro. I thought it was better. Oh, we just want... I just want Sludge Belchers is really what I want. I just want to get Sludge Belchers and Direhorn Hatchlings and be happy. We're a little farther up the curve, but I'm almost happier about that. Alright, see so up against our pal the paladin. And we get pretty late most of the time. Yeah, just sucks when we go late and we lose. We go late and we die. Now, something that we could do is we could just say, I hate dragons, because they printed a dragon hate card. What's the name of it? What's the Dragon Slayer Hearthstone? Yeah, deal six damage to a dragon, oh, three yeah. mana, four, six. Yeah, that, that might actually just be the thing that we do if we keep encountering priests, man. Like, cut the two unidentified right. shields and just run to the dragon slayers. That actually sounds good. Is that good? Are I mean, dragons killing us? Um, well, the priests are killing us, and they have just tons and tons of dragons. Oh, I, I was stuck on that. Murlocs aren't dragons, Sean. I think. There are no such thing 
is a Murloc, that is a trash. But I mean, it, it's still a three mana, four three, which is the equivalent body to a Mountain Fire Armor versus mm. Aggro. Um, I'm also, I, the unidentified shields have been amazing. The knowledge is so sexy. Mm, thank you. Oh my god, you know, tonight we're gonna have snacks. Uh, oh. We're gonna have, it's gonna be junk food night. Let's <laughs> move quickly. It's junk food. So first of all, we we're actually we're gonna be eating things mm. we shouldn't tonight. Oh my god, and you guys think we're being like in some way insinuating something <laughs> sexual? No, we're actually we're talking about like donuts. Just eating and snacks. And yeah, we're going. Shit. Oh yeah. my god, mm, it's junk food night. We haven't we haven't this spent is... time talking about this. I know Britt wants root beer floats. Really? Yeah. How do you? What do you? Put? Is there? Oh yeah, I guess that's not yeah. Is there gluten free ice cream? But of course! But of course! Oh man, root beer floats. Dude, we gotta get some like artisan shit up in that. Also, Al. Oh, never mind. Maybe today's not alcohol. Is today gonna be the first not real alcohol? Well, I mean, we have we have Peerless Rye Whiskey literally right here. Ah, uh, well. Yeah. Is this the one that you were looking for, or did you just pick another thing? Nah, I just picked another thing. Oh. I just chucked another one out there. Oh man, that stuff is powerful. Now I understand how it's confused. No, I mean it's really strong. It's like yeah, it's like fucking 54. Yeah, I like rye whiskey. You're powerful. That's why. Yeah, I'm a very powerful guy. I also didn't sleep very well. <laughs> so probably from the powerful whiskey shot. Well, and it, now we're like, oh, good thing that we did the stuff all day. Now let's drink the whiskey before bedtime again. Well, the thing is that like the, uh, it was the combo of eating. All those cheetos that we had, and I, because I, I mean, I, I just, oh my god, oh this is this is horrible. I have, so I have like a, a ritual that I perform when I drive here. I drive from Los Angeles to come visit Sean in Northern California, and I, uh, on my drive, I always get a, a bag of puffs, hot hot cheetos puffs. Like flaming hot puffs, Cheetos flaming hot puffs. I think is what they're actually called. And uh, munchies, flaming hot munchies, which oh, is the right. combination of sun chips, pretzels, uh, Cheetos, and a fourth and mini Doritos with flaming hot seasoning. So I had a few of these left oh, when I made it to over to Sean's place, and we imbibed. We invited some, some Cheetos we yesterday. We ate yesterday. We, it was, it was like, it was like on, on Shark Week when you see the sharks just like eating something innocent. We were just like, Argh! just like rolling on our backs and on the, in the bag of Doritos, man. It was so good. <laughs> Throwing them in the air and like catching some of them and then they fall on the floor. <laughs> Biting the, the edges of the bag as it pulls apart and Cheetos fly everywhere. And the cats are so confused this whole time, too. <laughs> they're like looking, they're like doing the, that, that cat investigate the situation at a distance thing. Now, if I just draw a sleep with fishes, we just instantly win. I feel like I need, like, maybe one more board clear in this deck. Brawl. And we're, we're, we're both about to die and about to win. Alright, so that helps a lot, right? So we can get, like, two whirlwinds and bring it on. Yeah. What's bring it on? Bring it on is just gain ten armor and reduce the cost of all his, all his men. Oh, his hand. Yeah, so I think I'm just gonna... What? I get this. I can't... I don't have an answer to that. Depends on the animal. I was asked whether I like cats or dogs more, and it really just depends on the individual animal. Yeah, we, I mean, I had sure. a of really good cats. Really excellent cats. They're incredible cats. I first, and the, I haven't had a, a dog for many years, because I had a dog that I loved a lot, and when I was getting ready to go to college, we had to put him down. Mm. Um, that's probably why I dropped out. But the uh, the vet when we were putting him to sleep missed the like vein, the like 
like the right vein when they were putting him down, and so he was just like writhing in pain, and they had to like reset this thing. And so I'm like, mm. you know, helplessly standing by as my best friend for ten years. Oh my yeah, god. Rides around on the fucking veterinarian table and you're like hearing it like it's whimpers and shit. Jesus. So I haven't got another dog. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. I did love, I had a, I had a cat that I loved quite a lot uh, that went with my ex. That his name was Archer and he was a Singapore. Oh my god, that cat was... He was a smart little motherfucker. Was... Oh, wow. Oh my god. A Megasaur. I'm a gentle Megasaur! It's, yeah, it's not go. gentle at all. Oh, see? I cry when I'm happy too. Alright, I think I shoot her. I just kind of chill here. Yeah, I mean, a brawl would be nice. A brawl would be really nice. The moral uh, of the story is just go to a good vet. That's it. That's the only. That's the only story. Yeah, it's the only story. That's okay. It was. It was RNG. RNG. I loved all the times I had with him. Pets are still cool. I just moved. I like I too much to even have a pet now. Yeah. And why have a pet when you can achieve fulfillment from killing people on the ladder? I can tell you, I never have to deal with somebody euthanizing my laptop. <laughs> <laughs> Missing the vein yeah. in the laptop, and <laughs> your laptop's just opening and closing in pain. <laughs> oh, God. Hmm, this is bottle. Dude, I gotta, I gotta rethink this whole deck. See, I think that I can actually just... This deck is literally gonna be so much better with cold lights. Oh, of course. Of course. <laughs> of course that's what happens. I mean, we're, we're so dead now. We're so screwed. This sucks, man. You know what? I'm just gonna go Jade Druid. I'm just gonna, like, fucking win. Yeah! Just show them. Oh, good. Good. The torn. Boo. Boo, boo, boo. Boo, 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 boo. Hey, too much science. Can you elaborate on your question? Too much science asked either do you have any experience with the differences between a regular esports competition and culture compared and culture compared to fighting game esports. I've had a, a ton of experience in uh, in FGC also. Um, they, uh, the, the phrase you know that the phrase esports shouldn't really be used there, Mister, um, unless you're talking specifically about like the high end. But as far as yeah, as far as FGC goes, what's your question? Good to answer. I must protect Cyber Simeon, I really appreciate that, and I empathize so heavily with you. It's, it's really, yep. Oh man, a dozen times. Jesus. Oh my God. Gee, oh, that good Lord. That cat got the baker's dozen for God. euthanization <laughs> injections. There. Oh my God. Twelve from Pop, and he got the thirteenth from the vet. The light dims. This, oh, well, how does this deck work, Sean? This deck, this is this is just a great deck. You just ramp up, and then blow up. Oh, people good night, up. John Limitless. John Limitless. You help people so much. Dude, John Limitless is yes. great. I, I was teasing John Limitless earlier today, so I appreciate that he yeah? hung around. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Because uh, he was trying to type his sub message, and it kept refreshing, <laughs> and not letting him do it. Oh. So I was like, tease, 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 tease. This, I actually think this deck is sensational. It just really sucks when you go play against someone that has a skulking geist that blows up your jade idol and you're like, well, can't win. <laughs> oh. See, so yeah, it's just, then your strategy is just draw jade idol before you Reporting for duty. No, you just, you just literally lose. Like, this, this deck's win condition is draw your whole deck and then play jade idols until you win. It's rough. It's, it's <laughs> pretty bad. It's pretty rough when it really, really kills you. All right, so how do we want to win this game? We could swipe right now, but I can't see that swipe. So just definitely need this one. Oh, I don't think so, because I can, I can do this, I can, and then I can use my Jasper spells to blow up the source of damage. Hit that, and then I summon the J Idol for this. And we're gonna yeah, summon, and then you're hoping that because he doesn't have a way to kill the thing, he doesn't have a skulking guys for sure. Oh yeah, almost no one's running Skulking Dice because there's very, very few Jade Druids. But there's recently begun to be that 
inner fire um, divine spirit priest, which can get countered pretty hard by Skulking Geist, but I don't even think it's a very good counter because, you know, you just like. Oh, great. Nice, hey! You found a card. Ooh. That was easy. Oh, was that the, oh, the easy that was easy. Oh, that's right. That's they sell those at Office that's Max. That's, yeah, yeah. It's a, was it Office Max? I think so. Or, or, or Staples? I mean, the same thing. Were they the same? Are I they mean, owned by the same people? I'm like, I'm no, like, I mean, what? How are the corporations aligned? Like, what, what is the? What's their holding? Do you have their incorporation documents? Like, reporting for duty. Sorry, guys. Uh -oh. Yeah, no, I've, I've, I've essentially no. What's their token split? <laughs> Have you read their white paper? Well, shuffle three jade idols into my deck because I can draw a billion in a second. I'm in perfect turn. It was a good matchup. No, You're I, perfect, Sean. Given the circumstances. But I, I love I love conditional perfection. That's, That's a, dude. See, I was I was raised on conditional love. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. Oh yeah. You so should now say. I'm like I'm a real I'm a real real transactional friend. I would know. It's, I think it's the right way to be. You're a really beautiful person, from what I know about you. <laughs> Always have a qualifier. I think qualifiers are part of. You're great so far. Don't say things like "I think you're great." Say things like "I think you're great." <laughs> I'll express a little bit. All right, let's blow him up. Bang! Bang! Oh, I think I accidentally clicked on his face. I did not. I'm the best. I'm the king of the See? underworld! You're the perfect. You're the perfect. I am so far. You're just sweet, the perfect. Just sweet. From the there grave. She's like, hello, I'm balanced. And I'm like, that's right. Reporting for duty. <laughs> so now you just begin to go for the face. Okay, so we're gonna we're just gonna summon Malfurion. So I do think your chat is the only absolute fun. Because they're always great. I'll just see you ten times. Pretty nuts. Do I just want to summon another Jade Gollum? The battle is over! Tyrannosaurus. It's so hard right now. Malfurion versus Damn, Look at this. Clan Master saying, Rob, I like that so cool beard. Begins. I'm great. What's that? What's that? What's Clan oh, Master. Hey. Oh, thank you very much, Clan Master. Do I want to just keep... I think I'm actually just going to keep branching paths for the armor, because Hunter's pretty easy for this deck, unless I just get voiced down. Why are you playing a legend when you're rank 6? Because he's awful. A 23rd rank legend when you're... That's crazy. I don't know, he looks... Do you only get one... Will you only get one star if you win? Or do you get more if there are many ranks above you? No, it's just a... A win is a star, a loss is the loss of a star. Candle shot. Oh, he's, 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 uh, my beard is almost as long as that. Yeah, you know, really, the beard only count like this is the beard. I guess that I guess depends how you define almost. Yeah, I don't have much forehead, so yeah, I'm surreal. <laughs> so this is a, this is a spell hunter. I think it's part spell. Should so just crush it. Could I, I actually really think that I would just oh, no, like, completely demolish this deck. This deck. Crush it. Oh yeah! Oh, I gotta wake up because we gotta have snacks. Ah, snacks! Oh god! Oh! Oh! This is this really sucks. The only. Oh! <laughs> no, he, oh, is that how that's built? He like that's only, only runs bars. Why charge it? Which is which is so stupid and funny. Okay, wait. So do if you I... not do you not spreading plague? Yeah, probably do. Or, wait, he doesn't, if I... he doesn't cast anything else, right? No, so I mean it's pretty good for me to just get the spreading plague out. I think it's better for me to have one less. <laughs> yeah. 
This deck, this is like how this deck wins, is that you just get like a fucking turn four Elisha RJ. But that's like not that good. I, I, I don't think the rest of the deck is, is so great. Okay, so he's definitely gonna have like, two, you know, you two Call of the Wilds. He's gonna, he can't play, he can't play Savannah. Okay, so I'm actually gonna... He's gonna have to destroy left and right thingy. I actually don't think that he will. So that guy can't heal at all, so I'm gonna go ahead and draw the card right now. I mean, we're gonna take some damage here, which sucks, but that's alright. Actually, I should have killed this one and hit this one and taken the 10 anyways. That's what I should have done. Uh... Hopefully that is not... There's nothing that counter spells, right? Like, nothing that can change the target of your spell. So we're, we're, we're gonna take some damage here. I mean, our hand's pretty face up as is, so that's okay. These two are so amazing to have together. A long time. Because we're going to take a lot of pain here. I mean, he could have, like, double animal bite and die, but... <laughs> nice, 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 nice. Okay, so... I'm going to... So let's see, what could this be? This is probably a wandering monster, so I'm just gonna attack like this. Okay. It stinks a bit, but that's okay, so we're gonna do this. And we're going to do this to gain a bunch of armor. Good thing we are the armor gain class. Druid! So I'm just like, all I'm doing is playing decks that gain a lot of armor today. Which is pretty sick. Like, I don't know. I, I, that's fun. fun it's as a well, it's interesting, right? Because if we're thinking, if we want to think philosophically with you as a player, you want to make interesting decisions. By having armor and extending the game, in theory, there are more decisions to be made. It's pronounced the same way. It doesn't help me. Come on, Infinite Mist. Get with the program. Be cool like Shaz. The Shaz. And so I think I attacked this twice. I think I am going to just... That is a sick draw. We were like real close Is to just like ending. Fucking dead. Um. Well, he just filled his hand with random spells, so no one knows anything anymore. Oh, he's probably gonna just shoot it for a one. I'm not shaming you at all, Infinite Mist. I was asking. For you. <laughs> you told me that was how it was pronounced. Ooh. There's a lot going on on his on his end, man. And he's probably got Call of the Wild next. I was he, he had to remove so sad. He must have Call of the Wild. He mustn't! Um, okay, so I'm gonna Oaken Summons to summon, hopefully, not find the old one. Stay, huh? So, we're kind of like within range of being able to kill him, but... What does that do? How did this... Oh, did you get both effects of cheese? Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow, man, that's so sick. Oh, man, that's the soul reads. He's gonna have to clear. Yeah. Like, he, he must. He must clear. Okay. Alright, well, we won. This is four damage. Alright. Dude, 
we beat the turn four. Why charging? Oh, that's House Mouse. Why charging? Why Why charging? Why charging? I, I think it's Yasharaj, but what a stupid. You can't, okay, you can't convince stupid. me that it's Yasharaj. It's Y Sha R. I, like, I don't know. I played World of Warcraft. I got some weird shit. Yeah, it doesn't. That, it literally doesn't make sense. It shouldn't. It's ma it's it a, shouldn't it's make sense. It's a universe sense. <laughs> that was made up from a person. Oh, sort of. No, let's just. Small it, team of people that just made Howard, it up. It's just literally Howard made, made up. up. It's literally yeah. <laughs> It's a ran. That's just as fine. Because I have removal, removal, and a huge dude. <gasps> is this our promotion game, or do you have one more, and do you need to win two? Well, I need to win, like, two more games, man. We're going to get... Literally all day has just been the grind of five. Grind it's, of five. It's, and then snacks. By the way, should we get pizza tonight? Only if it's nice pizza. Like, Domino's. I'm thinking Papa John's. Papa John's is mine. I will not eat Papa John's. Really? Yeah. Where is my land party? Oh, From that's Pizza good. GG. I'm just shooting both of these guys. Never forget. Wait. Never forget Pizza GG. This is ringing bells. What is what is the lore behind the Pizza big, GG? the big EG promotion like across StarCraft when they did that Pizza GG drive. And there was yeah. like, then they hit all of the stretch goals and they're supposed to be, I think, some like epic land party or tournament or like bar oh. craft or something huge. Where and is then it just pizza? like, just never happens. Just I think I could be totally wrong. Don't pitchfork on it. And it might be That'd be so place. funny if they delivered on all their promises and Rob's like, just fucking, and I'm just like, he's stirring the crock yeah. pot. He's going to let that drama steep for six hours. It's like, well, I'm pretty sure that I read some other stuff somewhere on the internet said not great things about Papa John himself. I heard that Papa John is a man who has opinions and yeah. when he says them the NFL breaks in their relationship with Papa John. <laughs> <laughs> I think is what I'm recalling. Oh, dude, look at that. <laughs> These pads are going to break so hard. Oh, wait, does that mean that you get to pick twice? You get just all of nah, the things. Nah, it doesn't just does it doesn't do anything because this is a choose twice card. This uh, is your choose one cards. Okay. Okay. I can't wait for for Fandriller Stag Helmer, which is your choose twice cards. Let you do everything two times. <laughs> <laughs> Fandriller. Hmm. Fandriller Stag Helmist. <laughs> your Allows all cards with. Your cards with choose written anywhere on them at all, anywhere, oh, happen. Wrath pretty cool. Oh, watch this. I'm going to hit this guy. Oh, and then I'm going to wrap this one. Bam! Draw a card off it. Oh, it's Jade Idol. Sick. We're going to summon it. Here we go. Oh, bang. Oh, my God. Look, Kool-Aid Man. It's, it's Omer. Kool-Aid Man. It's Omer. Okay, great. It was a shit show. Omer, hey, man. Thank you for being the most oh my factually God. correct friend on the planet Earth. All planets, actually. Now, here's Every the, planet that I've ever been to. Here, here's the thing, is that the reason that Omer was able to find that so quickly is that Omer doesn't work. In fact, he doesn't need to work. Anytime he just goes to like a grocery store or restaurant, he just Jedi, he just does this. He's like, I don't need to pay you. And they go... You are a very charming, handsome man, and then he doesn't have to do anything more. No, and so, uh, the the that's right. So this is this is actually how his entrepreneurship empire has grown. Yeah, yeah, and in fact, um, this gives Omer all the free time to understand every bit of controversy and meme from all gaming communities. So that's why you're able to bring it up, and because uh, meme encyclopedia, yeah. meme psych, psych memeopedia. Yeah, dude. I mean, seriously, Omer like. It's like if there was like a Britannica's like world encyclopedia thing, it would be Omer's yeah yeah memeopedia. The okay, look at but you should check out that thread though. Draw draw your own conclusion. Pay no mind <laughs> to my own opinion. Just that is check out that the is, thread for this Papa John's thing, man. That is the drama mongerous thing I think you've ever said. It's just draw your own conclusion. Draw your own conclusion, and also I'm implying that I'll think less about you if you don't agree with me, so that you're being pressured into a conclusion that is not your own. 
Think what you will. Isn't that, yeah, think what you will, but everything about my argument thus far has shown that I think you're a piece of shit if it's the opposite. <laughs> Not true. Mostly. I think I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this for one draw, one armor. I think I'm gonna draw one. Let's see what that means. I'm gonna draw another one. Well, okay. Nothing but ash. You wanna attack the middle dude so that you're spreading plague dudes to the I wanna reduce damage. Alright. Get that damage out of there. Get it out of here. Yeah, but um but uh yeah, I, I, the, the, the way I knew that Omer was Ooh, had knowledge great of frames. Encyclopedia Meme Tanica. There it is, Encyclopedia Meme Tanica. Nice job, Blind Prism. Solid. Blind Prism died five or six times in Into the Breach. Uh, well, yesterday. now he did take it from maybe Pathfinder <laughs> Tenso high. above him. So, credit to Pathfinder Tenso. Oh you get all God. the royalty checks. Oh, this is great. Yeah, we're going to just go. And I do not want to play this because I have no card game. But dude, the uh, I, I knew that Omer was the encyclopedia of memes when he said, quote, I brought up Castlevania Symphony of the Night and he said, quote, oh, let me give you my favorite Symphony of the Night meme. And I was like, you've consumed enough memes about like a 20 year old PlayStation 1 game that you have a favorite. And he sent me, he sent me a, a, a true, uh, Twitter.com slash day nine T. No, no, no concession necessary, Blind Prism. You're both clever. It's just he was f faster clever. You gotta give him credit. Yeah, we look. Want, we want to give him positive encouragement. Yeah, no. It's on Twitter. <laughs> Not all men. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what is a man? A miserable little idol of secret. Not all men. <laughs> And then the fedoras. This is he's uh, such a nice guy. Look at this guy, he's just chomping himself to death. Oh, no, someone someone hates playing against mage as much as I do. Ooh. What's that summon thing? The four cost that you have in your hand. Fourth card, four cost. Uh, Recruit a minion. So here's what here's what I'm gonna do. I'm back! Get this guy right in his, <clears throat> right in his teeth. <laughs> yeah, there it is. That's yeah, where the right punch is going, right, right here. Yeah, and right in his, his teeth. His, his tooth. Heinlein, Heinlein, you're gonna get a real punch in. Oh, oh, he left. All right, hey. Hagen does. Scoops. All right, finally, we're gonna win we're gonna again. If we if we win this and get to rank five, we should celebrate with the. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh yeah, because we're also gonna want a little alcohol in our body when we're making decisions about food. Ooh, that's so that we're smart. making. That's... We want to make some loose decisions. I don't, don't want to be, be thinking about being responsible. Well, let me let me send some text. Now. Okay. So. I must protect the oh, let me check with Mike. We're against we're against our pal the paladin. That should be free ladder points. It should. It should it should just start off and spawn. Job done. I'm the Danny Sources. I'm about to have a glass of my favorite rum. Do you have a favorite liqueur? Um, I think I would say that my favorite is few rye whiskey. I think it's my favorite. I think it's my favorite liquor. Favorite liquor of all of them? I think so, yeah. <gasps> it's oh, a moosh. I have a different favorite for each spirit. Yeah, I. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh. Well, because, I mean, for me, I don't really drink anything except for. Except for whiskey? Whiskey and. 
Jin. Jin, I was recently turned on to Monkey 47. Pretty sick. So check it out. Um, oh, I'm running insane. For Rai, I'm real simple. I'm not like bullet. I like bullet Rai. For Rump. Bourbon, there's a Kentucky Straight that I like. What was the... Oh man, Rum. Jesus. Report oh my god, wrong. he coined out Stand Against Darkness! He what? coined it out! Oh, oh no! This poor G guy. G what is this? Rum that I was buying from... Where was it? Doing? In South America. When I was doing that top shelf Long Island thing that I was like way obsessed with, it was like right after we first met that I was like ordering the most exotic ingredients I could find to make like the perfect Long Island. It was really just an excuse for me to drink too much. I think the cat's eating your headphones. Oh, they're your headphones. Hey, come here. Come here, mister. Did she miss it? What are you doing? Wait, hold on. Let, let, me, let me move this cat. No, it's okay. She moved. Okay. Well, Sheriff is just fucking chilling on the beanbag. She's just like, I don't, I'm not involved in this trauma. Oh, Sheriff and I are cool as shit, man. Sheriff will come hang out with me when I'm napping, when I'm sleeping. I'm s oh, did she? Did she? Yeah. Oh. Did she? Did she climb on your head when you were sleeping last night? Just want, just for, very briefly. Such a good. Leave me alone. So I'm just gonna begin to go in. Oh. Yeah. So here's here's this is a really oh, nice God. wind condition of the branching paths. So you can just like. If you have two or three dudes on the board, you can just suddenly burst out a ton of damage. Mm. In a pretty nice position right about now. That was. Oh, I guess he couldn't have attacked with that. Wow. So this is five, six, seven plus. Yeah, great. Rank five. Rank five. How many fingers is that high five, huh? How many fingers am I holding up? Five, Rank five, five fingers. Rank five. All right. Now let's immediately do this. This is a skip from rank five. Yeah. I'm Fuck it. All right. So let, let's do the. You know what? A few things are going to be better than a disco party. Are you playing? You know what? I'm going to. Another silly deck. Oh, yeah. So first things first. You know what we're making? Lakari Sacrifice. Okay. Where's the other where's the other discard ones that are good? Well, there's only one that we need. Destroy all minions, discard your hand. This is This is it. Silverware Golem? Yeah, we're putting that one in there. Whenever this minion takes damage, discard a random card. I can see some treachery in our future. Alright, how do we make how do we make the best best deck? Has to be a warlock. Yeah, I mean we can just we can just hit this Lakari sacrifice. Oh, you want it to be like a good warlock? Oh wait, no, you said Lakari sacrifice, JK. Yeah, Lemeo, Lemeo, Lemeo. Uh, choose a friendly minion to give to your opponent. Mm. Is there any good discard cards that we would even want to ever consider? Even. Oh, Deathwing. Dude, of course. I am the Danny source says that there's a deck helper. That's the best way to make a terrible deck. Use the deck helper, yeah. Oh wait, yeah, so you choose your final. This is good. We'll, we'll definitely want this Kobold Librarian. And uh, I think that we're just gonna not listen to that one anymore. Okay, wait, so. no. I thought, I thought what he was saying was, you choose the three or four cards you really want, then you hit done and auto-complete. <laughs> that, could, that could be, that could be a technique. Auto-complete gamble. So the thing is that we, we, we are going to need to be a control deck. We can't... Oh. 
Oh, yes. Get it ordered now. Dude, we're gonna do the great pizza ordering. Also, okay. if you guys order it, like I can pick it up while you finish your show. Oh no, that's okay. No, we're we're, we're gonna we're gonna finish this up. We're gonna order it. Let me tell you, the Papa John's that is by the house that I will not give any additional information about because it's uh, I don't want to dox myself. They're amazing. They're like the only. Well, you might be narrowing it down too much just by saying that. I mean, they have like one star on everything, but like, oh, okay. I I think they're amazing. All right, because I th I think we can actually. I think we can actually make ourselves kind of like a fucking sweet little, sweet little deck here. We're, we're, we're just removing, and the Zothing... Is there a way that we could put cards back into our deck? Yeah, but Doka, Sean doesn't care. I'm at his house, we're eating Papa John's. Do you want to get Domino's? Because we can, we can get Domino's. No, dude, it's cool. Alright, so we can't have Blood Reaver go I just man. wanted a reason to bring up Pizza GG. <laughs> That's all I wanted. And it's so fucked up that it's still the most effective like marketing campaign that's ever been done in esports. Because I'm still yeah. I, like I, I would not have tried Papa John's prior to, except for that that event. Actually, screw this, dude. We're gonna we're we're gonna make a successful deck that does not involve. <laughs> we're in. What? Encephalivore. Really wants to be able to grow a bear. Period. You want to be able to grow a bear. Period. No, he like, wants to be able to grow a bear. Period. <laughs> I have always wanted to grow a bear. Period. <laughs> that's a, That's a, There's a lot of volume in those. Yeah, I mean, I can't even imagine. Bears um, are big, man. He's a big bear. Um, <laughs> you wouldn't download a bear. <laughs> <laughs> um, what? 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 What synergizes with Cataclysm and Deathwing and stuff? Oh, what? I think cert I'm not the guy. certainly. <laughs> I'm like, I'm sorry, Sean. <laughs> Doom? Uh, Do you want to be able to draw cards? No, I just want to be able to. See, I think that all these board clears. You know, this is this is what I'm thinking. We're gonna put the Nazoth in there. We're gonna put in Rin because Rin's just sort of like a sort of like a good taunt. It's like a good a good taunt. Let's get let's get Rin in there. You have any other death rattle things? Uh, well, I'm gonna put in the plated battle. Ah, it's a plated battle. Plated battle. I'm gonna put in the mistress of mixtures. I don't even think we need that much more than this. Is is what we need? We can't put in blood reaver Gul'dan, because I'm already gonna be summoning so many three twos from Lakari sacrifice <laughs> that uh, you know what? Let's get it in there. We're gonna we're gonna be able to transform into so many different things, dude. Nizoth. You're like the uh, man of many faces. Yeah. You know what's that? What's the guild thing in? You know the show. You know what I'm trying to say. No. Ga what's going Game on? Game of Thrones. What's happening right now? Game of Thrones. What's that? It's like the. There's that group of people that can change their faces and shit. I'm not that far in Game of Thrones. This is like new to me. Omer added pizza GG to the Discord. Ah, many faced guild. A man has no guild. What? Faceless men? Everybody's saying different things. Oh, okay. It's faceless men. We've got two votes for faceless men. Many faced god. Oh, we, 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 need, we need a. Oh, man, look at this cheer. Nick Allen, what up? <clears throat> oh, my God, Nick Allen. He says, holy shit, is that Rob Simpson? Let me tell you, when Nick Allen tunes in and you're not here, he just goes, I ain't saying shit, and I never even know about it. <laughs> All right. How is he, how is he chatting? Cause, cause he's he's he donated he bits, permission. and that's the message. Oh, that's the message. So if, if you want to ask him something, he'll have to follow up with another with bit bits. donation. Or you could just sub. What are you using your Twitch Prime for, buddy? Hey, you should check out Twitch Prime, man. Nick Allen, I hope that everything's going well for you over at the squad, man. Got some good dudes over there. This is this is a deck. I hope you're working on your ICs too. So I'm gonna fuck up your ICs next time we hang out. You've, there's no way you've been practicing. I, I'm confident that you've been working more on your career in life than could be. <laughs> than could be your <laughs> yeah. You know, what, let's get some. Let's get some. Let's get some derpy heels in there. We have our defile. We have our hellfire. We. I mean, we. We literally are sweeper central. Let's put in some of these dark packs. Uh, what? What's something else memey that we could put in? Because I have two slots for memes. Despicable Dreadlord could actually be really good. That's actually just probably going to be excellent. It's going to be way too good. Sick. 
This is our disco party. This is a disco party. Are you gonna play ranked? Yeah, of course. Well, not oh my god. Like what? At, like, in the history of Hearthstone, I've never un here. Just get get your glass. I've never in the history of Hearthstone not played ranked with a deck. I've never been like, you know, let me. I'm concerned about these ladder points. Let me. I actually think that this deck is or that Warlock is sufficiently good. Oh, this guy, he has he has no idea. Yeah, sure, here you go. Let's get you. I am your nightmare. Yeah, that's actually an extraordinarily large amount. Well, we're gonna have to order some pizza. All right. Hey. To rank five. It was hard to get there. It was hard. Oh. Quite nice. That's good. That is good. Let me tell you something. Cheers, Entropy TV. Hey guys, cheers. Entropy. Cheers. It's Friday night. It's a cool name. Cheers. Oh, cheers. God, cheers. To you, cheers. chat. To chat. To the greatest, most wonderful chat in the That's entire you. history of Twitch. That's you. Mm. Just the best chat. Look, look at, look at Jizz Flores. He's like. I'm gonna run a top tier deck. I'm like, I'm gonna run double cataclysm. <laughs> All right. Well, so here's the thing: we can coin out Rin and Cataclysmer in order to just guarantee that we can blow this deck up. This is actually an insane good first card. Yeah. Oh, to so just have the quest though. <clears throat> yeah. In fact, I'm just gonna Let's fucking go. Let's get the Beatles. Gotta get the Beatles oh, out there. I hope the Irish people that play this game love to run out of plated battle. <laughs> a plated battle. Is, does two E's become a? Of course not. No, this battle. is not. This is not an accent that plated any battle. country in the world has Ple ever used. Ple I am. Beatles. I like to think of myself as an accent pioneer. <laughs> <gasps> an accentrepreneur. Oh my God! This an is. Accentrepreneur. No, this is. This is it. Oh my god, look at this, drag culture, let's go. Let's... Oh my god, look at this, I, I am oh. not even going to life tap. He's confused, he's like, what even is? Does anyone go so far as to look do like? <laughs> god, it's such a, it's an old meme, sir, but it checks out. Hmm. All right, what is he gonna do? He's, he's confused, he's like, why did this, why did this oh, warlock not me. life tap? No, he's not life tapping. No one's life tapping anymore. You know, I'll life tap once. Let me draw a key card here. He's gonna hit me with that well play, but then we're gonna coin out Ren. No, 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 we're not. We're gonna wait till turn six, so that way we can Ren and then coin out Dark Pack to blow it up, guaranteeing that he can't use silence for. I'm leveling oh my myself way too hard. Powerful. I'm leveling myself way too hard. Here's the thing. Here's what we're gonna do. Yeah, I'm, I'm, you know, like in poker, when you convince yourself of some weird, crazy reality that is not the case, you're just, you're leveling yourself unnecessarily. See? Yeah, I've never heard this phrase. Yeah, that's when you... The question is, how do we discard more shit? No, this is, this is the perfect hand to discard, because we're going to discard one, two, three, four, five. Oh, oh. we're going to have a sixth one. Oh my god, it's going to be a race. It's going to be a race. But who wore it? <laughs> now, now it's now. Do you draw? Because you have two HP. Yeah, I think so. Oh, nice! And you got a life steal. With the oh! Let's... It's been a it's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure hearthstoning with you, Robert. We worked real hard for this one. Now guys. here here's the here's the most hilarious thing. Okay. Once, we're, I mean, we're both going to blow up each other's decks, like, guaranteed, okay? But in this circumstance, I actually have... Ahead. I have a Cataclysm. I have two Twisting Nethers. <laughs> I literally have way too much board clear. Let's let's Nether Portal this. What's in the portal? A lot of 3 twos. Is that every turn you get two 3 twos? Yeah, at the end of every turn. We might literally lose, lose right now instantly, yeah. yeah because he's just gonna cube, cube. this. Yeah. yeah, that's gonna be that's gonna be a little bit tough. But you know, we're just gonna try to draw another cataclysm. We can also get out um, the super poopa. I'm act I I'm looking at this deck, and I mean, part of me is, part of me feels a lot of shame, like real shame, looking at this. 
Oh, I'm gonna really need you to be not. In a way, this is helpful. Yeah, hit that. Hit that. Yeah, don't we just like kill this fucking shit? So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Oof, that's actually. Don't we just attack face and then another? Well, no, I mean he's he's gonna blow up all his own shit. Start your turn. Oh yeah, so you just attack his face. Yeah, but I, I'm. The problem is that he's gonna be able to. Can we resurrect that? We gotta, we gotta keep it. I think I think it pulls the one down first because he played it first, and then it's gonna. Load this up first. How does it pull it down? Hmm. This is just one of the new cards. Oh shit! It's really good card. It's pretty sick. Because oh, that's like also kind of okay. Does he have Nazoth? He has Blood Reaper <coughs> Gul'dan, which I think is a real, real concern of mine. When does your portal spawn, guys? The end of my turn. So I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go for the Beatles. Go for it. The Beatles. I just, are you just gonna do two seals? I mean, honestly, I might just start double sealing every turn. Because in this, in this stupid game, we're playing against each other. I mean, if he has Nazoth, there's a real risk that we just up and die. Because he's just gonna, not Nazoth, a Blood Reaver Gul'dan. No, he burned Blood Reaver Gul'dan. We burned Blood Reaver Gul'dan. That's right. Hey, congratulations. <laughs> it's been a pleasure. Nah, nah, very well. Nah, nah. nah, nah. nah. Come on, nah. Wow, look at that. God, I can't even believe that I'm someone that forgot about that. Being the professional rank 5 player that I am. And I want to talk a little bit about the mentality of being a professional rank 5 player. It kind of works so like this. You evaluate what the meta is. Uh, you pick the top tier decks. You maybe go a little off kilter, but you, you're still trying to get to rank 5. And then the very second that you hit rank 5, you immediately throw your hands in the air and you go, Fuck this shit, and you make this deck. <laughs> It's a good time. So you get all the knowledge, all the experience, at the last minute, throw it the fuck out. What are you doing? This is Hearthstone. Get stone. it out. Have fun. Of Texas. I think I gotta, I think I gotta blow him up. You gotta what? I think I gotta, I think I gotta blow him up. I'm, see, uh, like, I'm at, I'm at 11 health. It's not I'm, a lot of health. I'm, do you not cast Mistress, I and then wonder. Twisting Nether, and then End Turn? Well, I mean, I would do, I would certainly pop these two birds first, but um, I'm slightly concerned that I don't have enough. I think you mistress twisting another. I don't think you have another choice, and you get the, and you heal for four, or you twist another first and then mistress no. after, or whatever. Trust me. No, I mean, I'm gonna do this. If you're really worried. I'm not going to do this. Yeah. And then I get two three twos back. He has no more He's defense. No he could have Nazoth. He could have Nazoth, which would be bad. But we're going to try to blow up his deck before that happens. And we get this next turn. Hopefully we get to do that in the final seal. Mm -hmm. I haven't got the final seal in my hand. This is going to take this. This is an okay life. I don't mind the life that I see. Okay. Um, He's right. digging. He's digging for Nazoth right now. He's being an Now, Tubby Strut, you're the you're the struttiest tubber. Now, I kind of want to six two. I think I just Nizoth, right? Okay. Or I could just summon two demons. Can he kill me? This is six and two. This would put me down to four. Does he have anything else? We used one tough. Dude, we're we're. We're a professional rank 5 player. We have to do that, which is awesome. Because things that, like, he can't blow up our deck for sure. He has to try to kill us this turn. Oh, didn't he just fuck himself up? Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that sucks for him. Oh, he messed up. Hey, hey, congratulations. Hey, it's been a, it's been a pleasure making this pile of cards with you. Wow. <laughs> 
unless he's got something else. I mean, no, we, we literally could be dead. We could be dead. Uh, he's gonna life steal. for force. Seven from heaven. Double fuck. Hmm. Oh, we could be dead. We could be dead. Yeah, we're fucking dead. I think we may have died. Does, do we have anything? Do we have taunt demons? I don't think I put anything in here that helps us in any way. Well, okay, wait, so you can kill... Damn. If you kill the little guy on the left with your little guy, and then you so do the heal thing, do you have anything with taunt? Once I don't, I don't taunt? think I have a single demon with taunt. Isn't that sad? We didn't play that thing. Well, here's the thing. What we're going to do is we're going to life tap, we're going to get Cataclysm. Yep. Boy, that was anticlimactic. I, Man. Wow. What is Blood Reaver? Yeah, you couldn't have gotten 20 off the couldn't board. Couldn't have. Well. Man. Darn. Well, I'm... I, I think that we need to play the game. We don't, we don't have enough time. Let's do one more game. Let's do one more game. Ten minutes ago. We're not going to... It's fine. It's, it's, it's staying here. It's staying here. It's staying here. It's staying here. But we're, we're like, we're pushing off. You know, we're playing another game. Let's go. Let's get it. You could have been Zoth for Rin. Ah. Oh. So you did have a I did have a taunt. taunt. We did have a de Okay. Yep. Guys? No, but Nazoth would have had I will fight with honor. Honor. Yeah. Well, you know what? We made a big mistake. We threw a game right out the window. And that's okay. Sometimes you just completely and totally fuck up. That's our stuff, man. Sometimes you just literally have the win in front of you, and you go, you know what? I quit. I'm out of this. Sometimes... Hey, to... to to being a ranked five professional player. To, sometimes they're hallucinations. Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. I actually think this cataclysm thing is tight. I think this is tight in getting the the summoning. Funny ass deck. Hit ten ten with three two hellfire and spellstone for seven. I couldn't. It was just a three. Surprise! Oh, just ordered homebrew from Caviar. Six, <laughs> six p.m. They haven't gotten in the car yet. I was Caviar. I don't like that. Like most nights or something. Yeah. It's like DoorDash. Hey, you want to bring it on? You want to bring it on? A little stabby man. Oh man. Do I look like? Give a damn. Stab this guy, cause I'm a stabby man. Ooh. We literally might never even trigger this, but that's fine, because we're gonna trigger Ghost Hunter. Yeah. Pow. Trigger Ghost Hunter. We're gonna upset him by having an anti Oh. See, we're gonna we're gonna am I thought that I'm like, man, I haven't seen a card named Ghost Hunter. What effect will you trigger, Sean? <laughs> <laughs> No, this is this is tight. This is way tighter. This is a tighter turn. I'm, so I'm, hash, I'm so hashtag tight. tight. I'm hash brown tight. I just say we start life tapping until we hit cataclysm and just do that. Just do it. Because I think that the difficulty of a lot of the the better control warlocks is they they have to time when they do the twisting nether. For us, we have two Twisting Others, two Cataclysms, and Deathwing. And I think that this is enough. It's amazing to think that I'm going to discard all of this. I just imagine having, like, a young child who's becoming a man. Like, he's just turned 13, and I have my arm around him, and I'm showing the battlefield. <laughs> I'm showing him our hand, and I'm saying, You'll soon discard everything that you see. All of this you will be discarding. <laughs> all of it. All of this land. All of the loot. This is all going to go away. As far as you can see. As far as you can see, you're going to be discarding. And to replace it, at the end of each turn, you will receive two demons. <laughs> a 3 2 and a 3 2. Do you remember when a knife juggler was a 3 2? Never mind that.
Uh oh. This is a tricky. I think I might have to like dark pack this to heal and then cataclysm. This is actually a good hand. Oh hi, Mark. You know, we we should, we could actually just order the pizza on. What is monitor? What do you mean order? She already ordered it. But that's her pizza. It's the gluten-free pizza. Oh, I thought that she put in an order for all of us. Oh shit, so we definitely should have ordered what she told us she was ordering. We right. should order right now. And then you okay, know, we definitely order. Let's do it right now. Let's sneak out another game. Oh, we can blow this up. This is why we get along, because we're just both degenerate enablers. Yeah. But we convince each other that we're both, you know, intelligent enough to make the right decision. Right? <laughs> No, we can't. We can't drop a lower rank five. All right, Papa John's pizza discount. Uh, oh wow, pizza.gg. It's crazy. Yeah, no, I mean, I literally. Oh, is it uh, Papa John's discount codes? I literally look this up all the time. Okay, so we click on this. Great. Did it. Put 40 off? We don't want the BOGO? BOGO? Yeah, buy one, get one. Nah. It's like... It's like YOLO, but so many for people that actually exist. Ooh, look at this. Radio promotions when I was at Wii. Oh. Oh! The radio promotions. You know, I'm just gonna keep I'm just gonna keep running stuff down. Okay, so here we go. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go to the menu. What? <laughs> Look at this. How about two medium pizzas? Like nine dollars each. Who even knows? Pizza is made of thing. So I'm gonna order. I'm gonna think. God, I'm getting a fix. Are you starting with cheese? You going Costco? Yeah. So how much sauce? I'm gonna go with extra sauce. Alright, pizza size is gonna be large. We're gonna we're gonna hit up those cheeses next. Uh, normal. This is just your pizza, right? You're, you're building. A this pizza is and then this I'm is a pizza. all for me, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get. What's the difference between deli pepperoni and pepperoni? I think the deli pepperoni is larger. Interesting. C'est intéressant. Well, it's maybe more like salumi. Oof. I think I think this is a good time to twist another. <laughs> And then I think I think I'm gonna start. I don't know, like literally all of these win the game. Okay, uh, garlic knots. I'm definitely gonna get at least one. Do you want any? Yeah. Let's go ahead and add that to the cart. Let's, let's, let's go ahead and uh, get some more. Uh, definitely need to get the pizza dipping sauce. Mm -hmm. let's get some barbecue. Really? At least, yeah, one barbecue. One, and then what is it? What's this one? It's a spicy. But, oh, oh my Honey God. Chipotle. I'll try one of those. The buffalo sauce is really good. I don't like buffalo. It's too vinegary. Okay. All right. So let me... So many how do we win this game quickly? Probably not in a Zoth. Probably do this. Dude. Boop. <gasps> Bang. Boosh. <laughs> Get that first seal out of there. Okay, so let's go back to the sides, and then we're definitely gonna want these garlic knots. These are just. Ooh, I should just not have a breadsticks. You wanna switch it up or some cheese sticks instead? Oh no, I've tried all this. This is this is the best. Uh, and then um, I just can't is... do that much of that flavor. So unless you're, you're gonna eat the rest of them, if I don't finish one. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <clears throat> all right. So what what kind of pizza are you want? We're gonna create your own. All right. It's gonna be a large. Yeah. What's at the top? What did you already skip? Ooh, do I want a thin pizza or a pan pizza? These are all questions. That's an accurate statement. I like to make things that are unassailably correct at all points. Technically correct is the best kind of pizza. It's actually the only kind of pizza. So, I, I really like original. It's thick. But not too thick? Okay. Okay, we'll go, we'll go OG. I'm starting with OG. Just regular? I'm, no extra sauce or anything? 
I'm gonna go squid. No, definitely extra sauce. Can oh, I yeah. change the sauce? Yeah. Ranch or barbecue? Yeah. But can I do barbecue half? No, 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 you can't. You can't. What the heck? Isn't that sad? Alright, extra's fine. I've got I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I know what's next. If I if you go square. Oh, let me just get. If you go square, what shape is the pizza? Like I assume it that makes it's the whole pizza into a square? Click it. Yeah. Oh, that's so weird. Oh, that's the cut. Yeah, that's it's the, just the, the cut. Normal. This is this is the guy that just Wow. These are no, two lazy no. ways to cut a pizza. Like why is why isn't there like fractal hexagon? No one even knows the answer to that question, dude. Well, I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna send him to the where the hell's your deck. What's up? All right, watch this. Moniker Blitz? That's what we just got retail me not all over. All right, so I think we're doing this. I think this is it. Yeah, this is fine. Cheeses? Normal. Uh, three cheese. Nice. Wow, nice choice. Yeah. Okay, meats? Mm, spicy Italian sausage. Okay. By the way, I'd like to just stress the way that we're going to win this game is going to be to none other than to Cataclysm, to discard everything. Which then immediately completes the quest, giving us the chance to play Lakari Sacrifice. Do you see this? Isn't this, this is a deck. This is a real deck right here. We're gonna go ahead and end the turn. We don't even really need any more cards. You want spicy Italian sausage, you were saying? That's incredible. Yeah, uh, spicy Italian sausage, bacon. Wow, okay. Uh, do you want any vegetables on that? Yeah, I want Roma tomatoes, jalapeno peppers, uh -huh. banana peppers, mushrooms. That's good. Let me actually just, let's really hurry. Let's just, let's just play the Dreadlords that way. He knows that no matter what he summons, it's a good No olives, get out of here. All right, so I think that's it. I think that's it. That's that's not a lot of money for that a lot that lot of pizza. Yeah. What? What is this Papa John? How did this work? Did yeah, I... hold on. I'm gonna apply this. <clears throat> oh, regular menu price pizzas. All right. Well, I guess I guess we can't game this. We only have one pizza. No, we have two pizzas. Where? Yeah, there's a large original pizza, forty percent off pizza. Okay, so here's my first name. Here's my last name. Email confirmation to this. That's weird. This fake one. Here's my phone number. We don't want to receive that. Now this is this is the scary part. Let's go ahead and fire up another game. This is where I have to type in my credit card number off screen. That's a lot of ones and zeros for being a credit card. <laughs> the real the thing that freaks me out is that I once did this. I once ordered and was typing in my credit card number off screen. But your credit card number, you can type in on the numpad. I have my numpad tied to my encoder scenes. So it just started to switch scenes all over the place and I was like, no, 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 no. Alright, okay, this ex the expiry date is going to be that month and that year. Oh. The name on the card is going to be your name. It's not my name, it's someone else's card. We are stealing. Uh, let's let's type in my zip code, which as you know is 99999. It's not technically stealing, because it is, Cause we're you actually, should see the amount of credit cards that get sent to his PL box. It's crazy, see. people are like, Sean, I'm really into FinDom. Please spend all my monies. <laughs> Look up Findom. Check it out. It's a thing. Review your order, and boy, I am going to place this order. It's going to be emailed to... Ah, uh, yes. Alright, so this is it. This is the final game. Let's go ahead and run out of Plated Beetle. I have had almost none of this. This is good. This is really good. Let me recap of that order. We got pizza sauce, pizza sauce, pizza sauce, garlic Ooh. knots, garlic knots. Um, a bunch of extra... A bunch of extra stuff. Oh, yeah. dude. I mean, we've drawn the nuts here. Bro. It's the dream. 
I always want them to drop in that. Hold on, I'm gonna use a restroom here. But yeah, it's financial domination. Fin down. Ah, great, great play, Dargaro. Right, by a porpoise, by something with fins. Oops. Hi, Sheriff. Um, it's like, am I gonna make decisions? I'm probably just gonna sit here and act like I'm gonna make them, but this is a Rob stream now. Uh, there's no longer a Sean with us. I, I don't want to make I don't want to make any choices. I, I want to destroy. All, I like I want to cataclysm right now, but it's like hmm, got some decent stuff here. And then and you know and we're gonna have a three three on the board. The question is, will he also have a Panther out? Does the damage resolve prior to the Panther coming out on the board? I feel like we have to. Sean, I I'm gonna cataclysm. I'm not gonna do it, guys. Not gonna. Now, Bliss Love, you gotta pay first, buddy. It's not. I don't do. I've I've traded in games. It's like, yeah, hey, drop all your SOJs outside of the town. All right, right inside. Look, I'm outside. It's fine. I have teleport. I have teleport. I'm gonna take all fucking shit. Sean, we're running out of time. Sean, I'm gonna I'm gonna cast Cataclysm. I got it, Sean. You hear me? I gotta cast Cataclysm. Alright, cast it. Alright, what is going on? Alright, let's end the turn. Oh, it all, is it only our minions? It's not all minions? That's really funny, guys. Wait, what happened? No, it's dead, it's dead, it's dead, it's gone. Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. <clears throat> Great. Alright, cool. Well, I mean... What did we discard? We discarded... Like Jaraxxus? God, that's nuts. not... Bad at all to discard. Seemed okay. That was not a bad discard. I was worried that he had the thing that he would just kill our shit. Whoa, fair's lulls. Uh -oh. So this could be a wandering monster, which is fine. It's a freezing trap. No shit. Let's run this thing out here. No oh shit. Uh I mean, you get two every turn. And does it only replace them, or will it keep casting two? It keeps summoning two. <laughs> Forever. Forever. Every turn. Till the end of turn. You're removed. <laughs> end of the game. Oh, we're gonna say turn. Oh, I kinda wish that I had, uh. Maybe we should have kept kind of close to the one of his dogs. Nah, because now we got him to use the. Oh, yeah. How do we make oh, that no. useful? need to do one damage to this guy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, you've got Twisting Nether next. Oh, man. Oh, man. Well played. What? We lost the game? We're already? The show's done. <laughs>